My name is John Korn. My company, Plug Away, produces special features for the new release of Casino Royale on uh, Blu-ray and DVD. Both Sony and, and uh, the Bond producers recognized that, that uh, the Casino Royale was a film that deserved a good, solid second look. For the material that Cloverland produced, you're talking at right at three hours of new special features material for the Casino Royale Special Edition movies. None of that material was filmed. Everything we did was produced in full HD, not with an HDV camera. It was produced at the top tier quality of HD production out there. And the wonderful history behind the film for over 50 years. It is a story that is every bit as interesting as any James Bond film that you've ever seen. Casino Royale is a novel written by Ian Fleming, written in 1952. So you're talking about a span of over 50 years between the time that novel was written and the time that it was produced by the Bond film producers. There had been a spoof version that had been done in 1967, there had been a television version uh, that had been done uh, in the 1950s in America with an American actor um, playing James Bond. The story of the first James Bond theatrical uh, film script ever written, um, which was based on Casino Royale, which doesn't have James Bond in it at all. We did another documentary really profiling the character of James Bond his creation, where he came from, how closely he was linked to Ian Fleming. Some people say that Ian based James Bond partly on Iva Bryce. He was my uncle, and he had gone to Eton with Ian Fleming. He'd been in the OSS. We did a documentary about James Bond's links to the Bahamas cinematically, where we were able to tell untold behind-the-scenes stories not only about Casino Royale, but also about Thunderball, Goldfinger, You Only Live Twice, Live and Let Die, uh, Spy Who Loved Me, For Your Eyes Only, The World Is Not Enough. We found it right there in the Bahamas, right next to where they had shot Thunderball. And we had the extraordinary backdrop of the water. And it just, at that moment, Michael, Peter, and I went, oh my God, it's meant to be. Stuff that you won't find on the special edition DVDs of those films, where we were able to go to the Bahamas, talk to the people who worked on those movies. We were able to do a documentary talking about Ian Fleming's personal links to the Bahamas. It is so appropriate that the first Bond novel would be filmed in the Bahamas. You can read all the Ian Fleming biographies you want. There are going to be stories in that documentary that even the most ardent Bond historian will have never heard before. But we didn't ignore the film that was made as well. We interviewed uh, Sebastian Foucault, who does the free running sequence. Free running is an art and uh, also it's a lifestyle. To use the environment as a, a way to develop your body. When I practice what I'm doing, I feel like animals. We also did a picture in picture commentary with Martin Campbell and Michael Wilson. It's filled with interesting anecdotes. Everything from in the beginning sequence talking about the gentleman who uh, Bond is beating up and killing in a bathroom and you know, explaining that you know, he was a surgeon at one time in his life and decided to chuck it all and become an actor. We actually did a, a Bond trivia game. With the BD Live features, you can actually create a game where people can choose their own level of, of difficulty that they're willing to play at, uh, all the way on up to some expert questions that um, I will defy any Bond fan or Bond expert to be able to get 100% on. And so the Casino Royale DVD has to me the most in-depth fun way to engage in a Bond trivia experience with other people out there and for people who can have their players set up for a BD Live experience, being able to gather a group of people to all play it together. And I think that's going to be a lot of fun for people. We're very proud of a lot of work that we've done for a lot of different studios over the years. Casino Royale, far and away, is the special edition that I personally am the most proud of of having anyone who has enjoyed the James Bond special features on any of the discs will find that the level of depth, the level of new material that is unknown even by the most ardent of Bond fans on the Casino Royale special edition DVD and Blu-ray is going to be without peer.